a husband and a wife sitting on the couch after a day at work. But they're not talking about the past. It's the future that's on their minds. I kind of wonder what it would be like. Neva McDonald has had diabetes since she was six years old. Now at 27, she also suffers from high blood pressure and renal failure. I wouldn't wish it up on anybody, you know. I've had it 21 years. She has dialysis once a week and takes insulin twice a day. But doctors say she needs a kidney and pancreas transplant if she hopes to live. I'm on the transplant list for the kidney and pancreas. It'll get rid of my diabetes. I won't have diabetes anymore. While she may be on the list, the average transplant costs $475,000. Her health insurance will cover the cost of the transplant, but she can't afford the follow-up care and medications. So the community will hold a fundraiser on Saturday. It makes me proud to live in Caldwell. I mean, people are coming together and helping. You know, it's really didn't expect it that much, but where we are actually getting help from people we didn't even know. I feel thankful that I live in a community that people are willing to help strangers. All in hopes of one day being diabetes free. Chris Vallejos, KAGS HD News.